This is for that big WBC, that green belt. You had it. Um, and in fact, I was looking over your record. If I'm not mistaken, your first world title was a WBC belt, even at 140. What would it mean to you to have that strap? Oh, it means the world to me. Um, wow. you know, it's, a new, it's a new chapter in my career. It's a new chapter in my career. Um, I've been in a lot of great fights. I've been in a lot of tough fights. You know, I'm a seasoned boxer. I'm a seasoned champion. And um, just regaining something that was mine. You know, it's like a it's like a bully. You know, steals your lunch money. You can't wait to get him back. And then when you finally beat his ass, it's like, yeah, I knew it was, you know, I knew it was a man trying to pick on me because I was quiet, you know what I mean? So it just was like one of those moments where I just kind of proved myself that, you know, I'm still the best fighter in the world. My follow-up to that is, uh, I talked with Sean about this, Errol Spence Jr. says that he's been promised the winner of this fight. If you're victorious, do we see a unification fight of Danny Garcia and Errol Spence Jr. in 2019? Well, absolutely. You know, if the money's right, you know, the like I said before, I want the biggest fights, the biggest money paydays. Um, I'm in the point of my career where, you know, this would be my fourth world title, so let the money start talking. You know, I deserve it. I face everyone they put in front of me. And right now it's just all about, you know, the mula, the money. <laughs> I got a family to feed. I want to have more kids. <laughs>